Troubleshooting Path Pilot Reset or Communication Issues is made easier once we isolate the controller, the controller interface card, and the DB25 pin cable from the machine. The 25 pin cable uses 17 wires dedicated to specific tasks. The remaining wires are grounded. For these tests, we'll describe and check pins related to fundamental machine communication, consisting of machine OK, X, Y, and Z limits, and accessory input. Machine OK is a handshake line between the machine and the controller. This line is normally grounded when functional. Using a small jumper wire or metal paper clip, we can test Machine OK by connecting pin 25 to pin 15. From the PathPilot status page, the Machine OK illuminator lights up. The axes indicators represent a fault in the axis travel when illuminated. These lines are normally grounded during normal operation and ungrounded when a limit switch is tripped. Accessory input operates similarly. Test these signals by grounding each pin to the jumper and observing the illuminator. Pin 13 for accessory input. Pin 12 for the Z axes. Pin 11 for the Y axes. And pin 10 for X axis. If your machine has an enclosure switch, the testing is similar. However, pin 11 toggles the XY indicator. and pin 10 illuminates the door switch indicator. Pin 12 Z axes and pin 13 accessory input remain the same. If your test results differ from those presented here from the machine connector end of the cable, repeat the tests from the back of the controller. The pin designations are the same. This will isolate the issue to a DB25 cable or the controller interface board.